are you sure you want to know about my last relationship? Because every time someone says they want to know this, it's really just a lie to say that they are really, really secure. But then they find out and it changes things, you know? Well, the short version is that I was very disappointed. I thought that this one would last a while. I mean, he was very stupid, ugly, and enthusiastic. I was kind of giving him a favor, but he left me, saying I loved him too much and, oh, and I was blocking his artistic expression. I was traumatized and became totally obsessed with him. I went to see a shrink and it came up that I had written these little stories for her where she asked me to expel all of my thoughts. So I came up with these stories about how I was going to kill him. All the intricate details about how I was going to do it and not get caught. Oh, no, I, I would never do anything like that. I think it was just some writing. And then I started liking the character that was based on me, who I wanted to see do all this wild stuff. Anyway, so I wrote it and by the end, they didn't even have anything to do with the guy. But this stupid shrink believed everything I was telling her in the stories. She said she had to call the police. She really believed that I was going to do it. Even though I told her it was just my way of dealing with it. She said, looking deeply into my eyes. The way you said it. I know you're going to do it. So it was my first and last session. I totally got over the guy, but now I'm obsessed that he's going to die somewhere from an accident, maybe a thousand kilometers away, and I will be accused. <laughs> Why is it that you become obsessed with the people you don't really care about. 